everybody, it's Lon Sybin with the key case from Kensington. It is a tongue twister for sure. What this thing is though, is a keyboard and case for the iPad mini all in one. And it is very tiny, as you can see in my hands here. Uh, it is not very big. It's about the same uh, length as a iPad mini actually. And that makes a lot of sense because you put your iPad mini on top of this thing. It snaps right in and I'll show you how that works in a second. Um, but this is the keyboard. I am not crazy about it at all. It is very constraining, uh, partly because there's these little walls up on the side here that it uses for the case function. And you really can't stretch your fingers out. So you often, you know, you feel like you're, you're kind of bunched up on the keyboard here. It's really not a very comfortable type surface to begin with. Uh, most of the keys are about the same size, so it's hard to figure out exactly which key you're hitting because everything feels about the same. Uh, I am a touch typer and I have been for a very long time, uh, and this thing just isn't working for me. I'm just really having a hard time typing on it. Uh, the other problem I have was that when you get it, uh, there is a, you know, just an instruction page here, just a sheet of paper, and the, this QR code to get the manual didn't work. And the reason why I was trying to go there was because I was trying to pair the keyboard up with the iPad mini here that my friend Justin lent me for this review. Thank you, Justin. Uh, and when I hit the uh, pair button here, nothing happened. It turns out you have to hit function pair, but they could have put that on the paper. That would have made life easier. So if you buy this thing, uh, know that is what you will have to do. Um, however, once you do get everything working properly, it does pair up very quickly. So uh, what it will do here is I'll just kind of uh, flick the switch here and we'll uh, take a look in the corner with that little Bluetooth thing lights up. It pretty much comes up immediately. So there it goes. Uh, and we are paired up and ready to go. Um, so I'm just going to pop into um, our notepad here and I have a little instruction to myself to start typing. So uh, I'm going to uh, just position this uh, normally just so um, and I'm just having a hard time, as you can see, like I didn't get the shift right. It gets, it's just, it's just hard to type on. I really can't type quickly on it. However, if you need a keyboard for your iPad mini, this will certainly uh, suffice. I did like, however, how uh, the case function works. So uh, what you do is you just kind of uh, put it in uh, this side down and then uh, snap it in place. And it, it makes a pretty nice snapping sound when it goes in most of the time. It's a little hard to get it in there initially. You have to break it in, I think. Um, but it snaps in really securely. And it makes a nice uh, protective cover for the screen. There is nothing that's going to get uh, through this. I think this is aluminum. It feels like it's metal. So um, I do like that feel. It is a little hard to get the iPad out, however, because it goes in really securely. And it is, I'm trying not to break Justin's iPad in the process here as I get it out. As you can see, it is not easy to uh, uh, relinquish control of your iPad to the keyboard case. And then if, once you do though, you slide it right in there. So, I mean, I could see this, you know, this tight grip it has on it uh, might make it difficult when you're trying to take it out quickly. You might end up tossing the iPad around because you're putting so much force in uh, to open it up. Now, the good thing is that when you do have it mounted in there, uh, there are these little protective feet inside here. So it's going to cushion uh, the glass bezel. So you're not going to get any scratches or anything like that. And it will uh, keep the surface of the screen off the keyboard. So you're not going to have like those little uh, dust uh, um, imprints from the keyboard in that, in that, on that side of the screen. So, um, so overall, I think it's, it's okay. I mean, it certainly is a keyboard and it works and it's functional. It connects via Bluetooth. Um, but I'm not happy about uh, the, the keyboard, the keyboarding comfort, at least for me, maybe the size of my hands are an issue. I mean, it might work great for someone with smaller hands. Uh, certainly, uh, kids would certainly do better with it than I will. Um, the Bluetooth does pair up very nicely. The case function is very, very secure. Um, however, it's hard to uh, get the iPad out of it. So that is the key case from Kensington, and this is Lon Seidman. Thanks for watching.